Hi, I'm Jay Nicholas for the Oregon Fly Fishing Blog. Welcome to the Oregon Fly Fishing Blog, our saltwater fly tying series. We are going to do a really nice little euphosid. This is, excuse me, a little krill like creature. And we fish this for silvers and for rock, black rockfish and for uh, sea run cutthroat trout. It's a Puget Sound fly, it's a Pacific Ocean fly, um, certainly a BC fly. It's a fly for wherever and whenever these um, oceanic estuarine species are concentrating on these little krill, little shrimp white guys. So I'm going to use some EP uh, crab and shrimp eyes. Um, these are actually, these are bigger. I, I have crimped flat the area right here. Tell me, help me tie these in. Um, th these are, these little, these are great little shrimp eyes. Uh, crab eyes, shrimp eyes. Um, you name it. Little eyeballs. However, they're tied on they're 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 made of they're made they're epoxied on mono, and if one did not crimp them, they would be really difficult to hold in place. So I'm bending them back there, and what I I've, I've actually got a bit of an advantage here. What I'm going to do to keep them out in that position, reaching for my cure goo, and I'm getting every, there's my tack free. I'm going to put a little drop of the goo. And that little drop of goo, when it's hardened, will help keep those eyes standing out. Kind of funny out there in the ocean. Um, uh, chartreuse crystal flash for the feelers. Um, when some, there are times when fish just you know in you know, the ocean bounty, but fish aren't feeding, and you can show them all kinds of flies, and they won't bite. Then they'll turn on. There are also times when there are bait fish around, or you can throw a bait fish pattern. By the way, this is an EP. Shrimp dub brush, and I think this is clear. Yeah, clear. Really nice stuff for what we're gonna do. Anyway, you can you can show fish a really nice um, bait fish pattern. They won't eat it. They'll ignore it because they are absolutely keyed in on these euphosids. And sometimes they're stuffed. Now, different people call it, some people call it crab spawn, some people call it little shrimp, some people call it krill. Uh, I don't really, I haven't studied these oceanic food critters. Don't intend to, but I know what I see in the fish's stomachs, and it looks like white mush with little beady black eyes. Um, and it, it, does, it, it does not have a chartreuse ice dub center. But that said, chartreuse is a real fishy color. And I tie these euphosids in a pink, as well as a chartreuse. I'm going to put on my EP shrimp dub brush, loose, uh, spiraled on, not too close together, and then I'm going to thin it out a little bit. So these fish, uh, rockfish and salmon, uh, cutthroat, now, I, I have not caught cutthroat on these flies, but I see what people are fishing in Puget Sound, and this is basically what they're fishing part of the time. 
Oh, I know this five's gonna work. Somebody's probably tied this fly already. I mean, this is a this is a variant of a fly that I saw written up by a gentleman who tied a euphosid for fishing uh, silvers in uh, Puget Sound at a time when everybody told him he'd never catch anything because the fish were uncatchable. And then, as the story goes, he did quite well on this little fly, or a fly very similar to it. So, I'm going to, now I'm going to, first I'm going to, la la la, what I'm going to do. It's been one of those days, folks. It's been a wonderful day. Wonderful day, tying saltwater flies. Wow, look at that thing light up. So, as I say, while the fish's stomachs will be full of mushy white, I feel very good tying this with a core of chartreuse ice dub or a core of, you know, say, a shrimp pink ice dub or a hot pink. The ones that I have fished and had, because I fished them, I've had the most success on them. Imagine that. Excuse me. Are the uh, the chartreuse and the shrimp pink? I stud. There you have a beautiful little euphosid uh, size six Daiichi X point saltwater hook. Those little beady black eyes. The fish eat them. They eat them like crazy. Have fun. Have fun tying these and fishing them. Thanks.